You know, I hate oatmeal. It's not food, it's paste. <laughs> I want to have what you're having. How about you? Oh, grilled cheese. I, no, you can't have cheese. It's not on the doctor's list. Okay. Soon, though, right? Scotch. Call me crazy, I'm going to say no to that, too. How about a measly old beer? Okay. Really, Colonel? This is torture. Tell me about it. Hey, Owen. How's it going? How's he doing? Baby steps. Do I need to send in a rescue team for you? No. Um, are you between scenes? Yeah. Yep. Well, listen, thanks for calling to check up on him. I'm glad the movie's going well. And I'm, I'm really proud of you. I'll talk soon, OK? OK, bye. I guess his legs are broke, huh? Don't you get it? He's checking up on you, okay? This is his big break, his dream. Is it ever enough for you? You don't have an appointment. I'm sorry. Please help. No, I'm, I'm not prepared to do a reading. No. I'm sorry. Please. I'm lost. And I need you to do what you said you would do. Yeah, well, you know, sometimes there's energy blocks between people, and I think that's what's happened to us. But I'm so tired. I can't do this any longer. Okay. All right, I'll, I'll try to find a way to help you. Hey, go on. Hey. Cheers. Cheers. How you doing? Good. Huh. What's going on? Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> Boy, I have known you for a long time. Something's not right. Is it your father? No. Then what's going on? Why don't you let me help you out? Ah. Uh, I lost a movie weeks ago. Yeah. Oh, and I'm so sorry. I really am. Uh, you know what they did? They heard the producer's son. <laughs> so fucking embarrassing. Dude, this happens all the time. Come on, man. I mean, the entertainment industry is all about... This was my now. shot. This was it. 
You know? Really? Yeah. Oh, and there are gonna be other parts. Now, what you need to do is tell your family. They'll understand. If I know Gina, she's gonna wanna kick somebody's ass, and Gaia, she's gonna rally around you. Boy, you need to start talking. Yeah. What about Sammy? I mean, that's what relationships are based on, isn't it? Love and trust and being honest. I've been lying to her the whole time. What is wrong with you? You know, it's beautiful outside. Why don't we go for a walk? No, thanks. You have to leave the house eventually. Yeah, well, I'm not going out with the cane anymore. You know what? Ever since I was a little girl, you cared more about appearances than what was actually going on in your life. It's good to see nothing has changed. That's not true. The doctors say if you don't exercise, you might lose the use of your legs. Doctors are all quacks. <sighs> Will you just be a good daddy and humor me hey, for well, once? Well, I got a question. Well, what are you doing here? What? What are you doing here? I mean, you have this big, important job, and you've got this... Real active love life. You never cease telling me about why aren't you out doing those things. You don't want to know about my life, especially my love life. Are you in between women? <laughs> oh. Oh, oh, no. Yes or no? You really want to have this conversation? Yes. I'm taking a break. A break? Uh, what's that? A break? Uh, just... No, okay? No, I'm not in between women, okay? I just realized. Realized? I realized I'm in love with someone. Someone so special I didn't feel worthy when I was with her and I ended up breaking her heart. And now we have a friendship that I cherish. But she's with someone else, and she's happy, and I'll just have to love her from a distance. And I accept that. You accept that? What the hell kind of crap attitude is that? Hi, Alan. How, how are you? Well, I'll tell you how I am. You are either not giving Gina my messages or she's too busy to call me back. And with a major deadline looming, I do not have a finished design on my desk. Well, I, I, kn I know she's been working really hard on them. I'm, sh I'm sure she'll be done very soon. Well, I hope so, because I'm going to ask for those finished designs to be delivered to my office in 24 hours. And if they are not there, I'm going to have to pull her off this project, which means a lot of money down the drain. My money's on Gina. This should, she'll have them to you by tomorrow. Let's hope so, because all those investors have lawyers, and those lawyers like money. Gotcha. Hey. Uh, hey, yourself. Beautiful day, huh? Oh, I know. I know. I thought I'd try to finish my book. What's up with you? Oh, just taking a walk. I'm trying to clear my head a bit. Are you okay? Y yeah. I'm, I'm hung up about a decision I have to make. I'm trying to decide if I'm going to keep a secret from a friend that I care a lot about, knowing it would kill him. And I can't figure out what to do. You take time to consider everything, but in the end, I think you should tell them. Yeah. Yeah, I think you're right. Thanks for the sound advice. <laughs> Enjoy the rest of the book. I will. See ya. Bye. Enjoy. Mm. Your life's safe. Mm. Uh, have a good night. I'm going to go uh, hustle someone down at the pool hall. Huh? OK. All right. Good night. Good night. Oh, move. Oh, wow. <laughs> the hustler. <laughs> <laughs> so things are really heating up with Brandon. Oh. 
He's an old soul. What? What? How's the movie? How's Sammy? It's it's good. Well, that's really boring. Ooh, okay. Thank you. Never mind. Gina, you? I'm just peachy. <laughs> you're, you're never gonna believe who I ran into. Who? Richard McAndrews. <gasps> I mean, it was totally random. Are you kidding me? Well, that's perfect. Why aren't you sending him to see the Colonel? He's always his. The perfect son he wanted. Oh. Oh my God. So, mom. what's he doing in town? Is his family still here? His mom. We're gonna get together and have coffee and catch up. Catch up? And then you're gonna tell him you. Okay? What? What? He doesn't know that? No! You what? never told him. Because. Because huh? what? Because things were complicated and there were a lot of things going on at the time. Is it, yeah, because you took off when you broke up. Well, because, you know, I was trying to avoid certain peoples. Oh, speaking yeah. of which, how is the asshole? He's a fucking... Oh, no, Ooh. wait a minute. No, 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 no. I'm trying a new tactic here. Nice. Okay. He's what you might imagine him to be. An asshole. So, <laughs> let's play this game. Right. And no one knows it. If I were an asshole. We haven't done that in a really long time. That's a good idea. I like it. Wait, wait, wait. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's in, what was that? What's what? Oh, what? If I were an asshole? You never played asshole? No. You're an asshole, hey. What? If I were an asshole, you pick a topic or a person, basically you can say whatever you want to say about them without worrying about going to hell. Oh, <gasps> this is like, like fun. This. Okay, what's the topic? <clears throat> I don't know. How about the colonel? <gasps> oh. Easy, could be yeah, fun. Yeah, that's it. Okay, I go first. All right. <laughs> if I were an asshole, mm -hmm. I would register him as a democratic gay man. <laughs> oh! Can you do that? <laughs> yeah! <laughs> They'd love it. I'm so proud. Oh my god. Well, you know, if I were an asshole, mm -hmm. I would change my fucking last name and never talk to him again. Mm. Oh, that's such a Debbie Danner. Is that too much? Oh, yeah, that's way too much. A little harsh? My turn. All right. If I were an asshole, I would get him drunk and take him to a strip bar, leaving him only with his military ID for identification. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, that's good. You it's know good. that's good, right? Yeah, you hang around his ball bag. <laughs> <laughs> Stop it! Your aunt is present. <laughs> oh, 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 if I were an asshole, I would dump all of his expensive scotch and replace it with generic. Oh, oh that's just terrible. That's just oh. awful. That would just that would kill him. That, that would. I love it. <laughs> I, if I were an asshole. Mm -hmm. Or take that fucking Bobby Bowden football I put on eBay for five bucks. Ooh. Oh my God, that was really all it's worth ouch, anyway. Ouch, ouch. I mean, all right, ten. But really, <laughs> honestly, it's been really hard seeing him struggle like that. I mean, just just the fact that he could cut his food today was like a really big deal. I well, know your mom's birthday is coming up next week. That's got to be hard for him too, you know. Oh, I know it's like totally crazy, but I really think you should come by and see him. I will. I promise. Okay. Okay. I miss you. I miss you too. I miss you more. Well, okay. I miss you guys too. I miss you so, I miss so, you so much. So much. Check, please. <laughs> 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 Let's Get Brandon back topic. here. Or is Let's he hustling? Let's make you the topic. If I were an asshole. <laughs> <laughs>
I was so scared, I swung my arm back quickly to stop him. It was an accident. I hit Katie's hand. The hot coffee went all over her. I can hear her screaming about how hot it is, but I'm trying to put Van into his car seat. And when I turn back around, I see the tree. We're headed straight for the tree.